Hello, and welcome back to Short Stories with Daniel. This is The Bookworm Adventures, The Magical Book Club. In the charming town of Storyville, there lived a group of adventurous and imaginative kids. Lily, Max, Ava, and Leo. Each of them had an insatiable love for books and a wild imagination that knew no bounds. One sunny day, while gathered in the town's cozy park, an idea sparkled in Lily's eyes. I have an idea, Lily exclaimed, her eyes shining with excitement. Why don't we start a book club? Max, Ava and Leo exchanged intrigued glances, their faces lighting up with curiosity. Book club? That sounds awesome, Max chimed in. But not just any book club, Ava added. Her grin growing wider, a magical book club. Leo, always the thinker, furrowed his brow. What do you mean by a magical book club? Lily explained her grand vision. Imagine if we could read a special book that takes us into the stories themselves. We'd get to meet the characters, explore fantastical worlds, and even solve mysteries alongside our favorite heroes. The others stared at Lily, their eyes widening in awe. The idea of stepping into the pages of a book was too exciting to resist. And so, the Bookworm Adventures Club was born. They gathered their favorite books, books with talking animals, enchanted forests, and secret doorways and met in the park under the sprawling oak tree every week. Their first magical journey took them into the land of Whiskerwood Chronicles, a series about a brave mouse named Milo who saved his kingdom from a cheese-stealing dragon. As they read the words out loud, they felt a gentle breeze and before they knew it, they were standing in the heart of Whiskerwood itself. The kids were amazed by the sights. Towering mushrooms, rivers of chocolate milk, and glowing fireflies that whispered secrets. They helped Milo outsmart the dragon using quick thinking and teamwork, earning the gratitude of the Mouse Kingdom. Their next adventure took them to Starship Galaxy, a tale of intergalactic explorers. With a flash of light, they found themselves aboard a spaceship, zooming through the stars. They helped the crew solve space puzzles, deciphering alien languages, and even befriending a robot that loved to dance. As weeks turned into months, the Bookworm Adventures Club faced challenges, solved mysteries, and formed unbreakable bonds with characters they met in their magical journeys. The stories they experienced left them with lessons of courage, friendship, and the power of imagination. But one day, as they finished a heartwarming tale of a dragon who just wanted to bake cupcakes, they found themselves back under the oak tree, books in hand, faces tinged with sadness. It's been amazing, Max said, a hint of nostalgia in his voice. Yeah, but we've run out of books to read, Ava added, her eyes a little misty. Leo glanced at his friends, a 
mischievous grin spreading across his face. What if we write our own stories, create our own adventures? The others blinked, then smiled as the idea sunk in. And so, the Bookworm Adventures Club became not just readers, but creators of stories. They wrote about flying elephants, time-traveling bicycles, and popcorn that could grant wishes. Their imaginations soared, and their bond grew even stronger. And so, in the town of Storyville, a magical book club continued to meet under the oak tree, their stories weaving a tapestry of friendship, adventure, and the limitless possibilities of the imagination. And whenever they needed a touch of magic, all they had to do was open a book and let their imaginations take light. The end. Thank you for listening. If you liked this short story, please click like and subscribe below. Thank you.